Thank you very much. As I was saying, the American Revolution started after the sign of the Declaration of Independence. At uh, its origins, it didn't have war intention, but it was a rebellion against the high taxes. Uh, these conferences are so boring. They always make me fall asleep. Come on, don't be so negative. There's only one hour left. Let's hope it ends quickly. And uh, the strongest European powers became involved. This is the most important thing. No, for science nation. is more important for okay, the nation. But how can you have all your scientific instruments without the taxation? The money. But you can spend also, all the money on the taxes. Also, it's important the power of the army. Okay, but the army. Okay, it's important, but it's not the first thing. Okay, we can't obligate military service because we don't have the money. I'm Just sorry. I'm sorry to contradict you, but in my opinion, we should obligate military service. A good nation is based no. upon the strength mm. of its soldiers. Okay, but how can you without the taxation from our people? And uh, if everybody is a soldier who gave the money to us? This is true. But we must remember our wars ruin our people. Exactly. I think uh, we should let scientists like me rule and introduce schooling for white people. No, Excuse no, no. Me, no who are you? What are you are talking fair. about? <laughs> Excuse me, boy. It's a mess of affairs. As I was saying, we should base ourselves upon some other answer aspects. Me? Our economy must be solid and cover the whole continent. Hey, but uh, this is the Declaration the of Independence. Yeah, um, well said, boy. We are discussing mm -hmm. what we should write. Exactly. Tell them, boy, a good nation must have a strong army. You know how I science is the most important. I come from the future. I already know what will happen and what the United States of America look like. And they are not like you say. What is it you must be more open-minded. Try not to base yourself uh, only upon your ideas. I tell you this because of the many mistakes that were made in the future. What are you talking about? They made a time machine without me? Um, I don't really know I ended up here. What are you saying, boy? Are you crazy? Here, take a look at this. There are 50 states which are part of the Federation, not only 13. But they are 50, not 13. But yeah, there are 50 stars. But how is it possible? But tell us about your America from your future. Well, uh, it's based uh, upon the basic rights of life. Liberty, life. pursuit of happiness. Life. Yes. Liberty is very important. Yeah. Pursuit of life. And also equal rational and religious rights. Equal rational and, and religious rights. rights. Life. Liberty. Pursuit of happiness. Equal rational and religious rights. Yeah. Very important. You know, I think, I think it's, it's perfect. perfect. It's perfect. Thank you. Thank you for your help, boy. We'll write this in the declaration. This is what we want for our future generations. And that's how the Founding Fathers signed the Declaration of Independence. Does anyone know their names? Uh, um, uh, um. Good, good. You there. What do you want to say? Me? Well, uh, I... Who were the Founding Fathers? Well, Washington, Franklin and Jefferson, who had different ideas, but uh, with the help of goodwill, uh, they wrote a perfect declaration. Well done, you listen well. We must remember that in order to obtain these rights, many people have fought for them, and it is thanks to them now USA is a great country.